The bride is now cutting herself a piece of cake. Next year, the groom will cut himself a piece of neck. <laughs> old J. Hogarth is a good old soul. Old J. Hogarth is a good old soul. <laughs> Someone call for a speech. What's that got to do with you? I'm the best man. The best man always wins. That's why I'm a bachelor. <laughs> Forgive them. They know not what they're up against. <laughs> now that this couple has entered into a state of coma, I mean matrimony, I would like to have them tell us what they intend to do about it. Not that it's anybody's business, and especially the worst best man I ever saw. But Laura and I are going to be the most modern couple in matrimony. We intend to retain our separate individuality. Hey, why? That's a good trick, even if you don't do it. <laughs> and you? We intend to take marriage apart and see what makes it tick. <laughs> For the benefit of the less intelligent among you, I will translate. Oh, 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 never mind. Mind. Oh, no. Nevertheless, I will translate. <laughs> this is a marriage of advanced ideas, a bigger and better matrimony. There will be individual latchkeys, toothbrushes, and telephones. But there will be community gin. <laughs> now that you have heard both sides of this argument, your applause will determine the winner. Suppose you sit down and give those brains of yours a rest. <laughs> the best man will give the floor to a better best man. <laughs> <laughs> Laura, darling, hadn't you better be on your way? Yes, Mother. A good idea. I allow my wife all liberty, but I do not wish her to associate with hoodlums, scoffers, and whatnots. Mr. Whatnots to you. <laughs> I'm afraid our wedding was a big success. Yes. It interested me more than any wedding I've been to in ages. Love me. So much that I'm scared. Happy. Sort of floating. Delirious. I'm so happy. <laughs> we'll have the longest honeymoon in captivity. 